relate. Um, I, I rarely ever talk about my son, but uh, today would be today would be his thirty third birthday, and five years ago he took his life. <clears throat> and I can still barely say that in a sentence. And, and for a long time, every day was, uh, <clears throat> the question was, how can I be alive on this earth when he's not? And I didn't have an answer. And those were some hard, hard days. But <clears throat> I realized that I could honor him by uh, helping people and serving people. It gives me a reason to go through the day. <laughs> Some days that's all I've got. And out here, there's a lot of people our age, and inevitably there's grief and loss. And a lot of them don't get over it either. And that's okay. That's okay. One of the things I love most about this life is that there's no final goodbye. You know, I've met hundreds of people out here and I don't ever say a final goodbye. I always just say, I'll, I'll see you down the road. And I do. And uh, whether it's a month or a year or sometimes years, I see them again. I can look down the road and I can be certain in my heart that I'll see my son again. you'll see Bo again. And you can remember your lives together then. <clears throat>